this is Grant Kukoff from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now, uh, we're talking for Planet Forward and the nightly business part. Now, I just happened to find Waldo here, and uh, I'm asking him, uh, what type of technologies are you using in your workforce to uh, make it more improve its energy efficiency? Well, right now what I'm doing is trying to cut down on electricity costs and everything else, you know, the whole footprint thing, carbon footprint, I'm sorry about that. Yeah, trying to lessen that right now. Pretty much. Uh, okay, and what type of alternative energy sources are you using through your travels? Uh, foot power. <laughs> well, uh, you, I mean, you, people are always looking for you. you get a, all right, here's the actual question. Alternative energy sources, question two. Alternative energy sources. You know, they should really look into uh, solar energy and how the... What's that process called? I forgot again. Can we take this? Can we do a cut? I'm sorry. No, no, I can edit. Don't worry about it. All righty, no problem. Basically, um... Oh, the line? Yeah, sorry about that. Well, I'm losing you too. Oh, okay. Uh, so, uh, alternative energy sources. They should really look into, um... <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's comedy. <laughs> it's going to go under humor. All right. Uh... What's that thing called? Photosynthesis. Yes, they should. They should uh, try to harness the same chemical processes found in plants to, you know, make our own energy. It's really crazy too. Right, uh, what type of green building materials are you using in your homes and your other type of structures that you're using? Wood. <laughs> Wood. That's it. Wood. Okay. Um, what can we do to better improve our transportation system? Um, lessen the amount of carbon dioxide just basically cut, have people cut down on the car usage you know people can walk everywhere and stuff so is there any last minute things you'd like to say to the folks at Planet Forward and the nightly business report um no but you can come and try to find me again everywhere you know so keep an eye out for me so in closing this is Grant Kukath from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you now this is Grant Kukath from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you now we're here for Planet Forward and the nightly business report and uh, we're here in the land of Oz, and yes. I found Dorothy here. Yes. We're asking her, how are they in the land of Oz um, using more energy efficient technologies? What kind of things are they using in the land of Oz? Solar energy, um, re, um, those green products that I use to clean with, and um, windows. Sealing your windows and your doors, efficient. Um, appliances, our appliances, our refrigerator, um, you know, stuff like that. Um, what type of alternative energy sources are you using in the land of Oz? I'm sorry? It says alternative energy sources. Alternative energy sources? Well, I catch the bus sometimes. Is that, is that? That's actually the next question. Oh, that's... <laughs> See, you're so smart. I'm so you're smart. Teacher, right? Yes. Thank you, Peaches. <laughs> um, yes. <sighs> so, um, now what type of green building materials do you use in the land of Oz? Besides yellow bricks. <laughs> We, we use uh, yellow brick. <laughs> now, how can we improve our transportation system? Everybody needs to give those cars up and start walking, exercising. So, in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to the folks at Planet Forward in the nightly business report? Everybody have a wonderful and beautiful year and be safe out there and save energy for our planet so that we all can live here in a nice, safe environment. Thank you. So in closing, this is Grant Kukoff from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Talking to you. Uh, this is Grant Kukoff from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now we're here for Planet Forward and the Nightly Business Report. Now we're here visiting Never the folks in Neverland, and I'm here with Peter Pan asking about green technology and how can we make our environment better. Uh, Peter, um, what type of technologies are you using in Neverland to make the environment better? Electric. We've given up using fairy dust, primarily because most of the fairies have run out of dust. We only have 
young twinks and they don't have any dust to give out. So we're relying on electrical energy and uh, wind energy. Yep. <laughs> uh, what type of alternative energy sources are you using in Neverland? Uh, like I said earlier, we're using wind energy, which is quite efficient for us. That way we don't have to, we don't have to fly anymore because otherwise we'd just kind of die on the turbines. So it's working out. Now, what type of building materials are you using? Are you using any type of green building materials? Uh, yes, we are. We're using a lot of plastic because, you know, we love plastic. Um, and how can we better our transportation system in this planet and other planets throughout the galaxy? We would definitely have to start um, flying. So we need older twinks to give out some of their fairy dust so we can all fly. So in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to the folks at Planet Forward and the Nightly Business Report? Uh, I would like to say that uh, going green is definitely awesome. Look at me. Green's the way to go. So in closing, this is Grant Kukas from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Uh, this is Grant Kukas from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now we're here filming for Planet Forward and the Nightly Business Report. And we're asking folks in this life and the afterlife, what can we do to be more green in the environment? Now, sir, what type of green technologies are you using in your life to make things more environmentally sound? Black and white. I can't really hear what you Black and white. Um, what type of alternative energy sources are you using? Uh, um, Tatum? What? Tatum? Tatum. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Now, what, what type of um, green building materials are you using? I don't know. Yeah, I know what you <laughs> How can we make our transportation system better? Uh, I don't know. Is there any last minute things you'd like to say to our viewers? Um, I just want to say hi. Hi, and no, this, is, this is Grant Kukat from the Predatory Lender and Planet Forest, and thank you, and see you next time. Yeah. This is Grant Kukat from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now, we're here for Planet Forward and the Nightly Business Report, asking folks throughout the galaxy, what can we do to become more green? Now, Mario, what type of technologies in Mario... Uh, now, what type of technologies in Super Mario Land are you using to make the environment better? Well, as uh, Luigi and Mario plumbers, we are trying to do the best things we can for the environment by using um, our trucks uh, run on batteries and our pipes are clean pipes or plastic. We don't use any lead free, any lead in any of our environmental things and everything is clean and safe. Um, now, what type of alternative energy sources do you use in Mario World? Well, we have special powers. Um, we have to go rescue the princess all the time because she's always getting locked up in the castle. So we have to use special things to save her, don't we, Luigi? <laughs> <laughs> now, what type of green building materials do you use in your kingdom? Oh, green building materials. Well, <laughs> Should I ask Luigi? <laughs> we, we build most of our buildings with straw bales and things like that so that we don't have to hurt the environment. Everything is recycled. Lots of recycled things. Now how can we um, um, better our transportation system? Well, we try to take the train as often as possible, but as plumbers, they don't let us on there with pipes, so we have to take our truck occasionally. So in closing, is there any th last minute things you'd like to say to the folks at Planet Forward and Nightly Business Report? Peace! So in closing, this is Grant Kukas from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you.